It's time to wrap up the regular season. The SEC tourney starts in a couple days, but first, we've got game three of this series between number 14 Alabama and Ole Miss. Well, Caitlin Riley was the tough luck loser yesterday. She is back in the circle today. She was only two outs away from shutting out Alabama for the first time this year. Still an ERA just under two and a half. Does such a great job out in the circle. Well, she'll get the pop-up to Allie, and Bama leaves two on base. Alex Salter gets the start today for Alabama in the circle, the sophomore from Fort Myers, Florida. Six and three on the year, an ERA just over two. So a runner at third with only one out, and an RBI single to left by Kaylee Hevelin. And the Crimson Tide jump out to the early lead. There's a drive to deep left field, and it's gone. Some showers out in left. And Savannah Sykes has just tied this game at one. Well, that was a missile. Line drive shot. And there's, oh, what a play by Kamoku. How about that stab to take a base hit away from Broadfoot? Hevelin with a 3-2 count. Fly ball, deep left, Whitley giving chase. Will it stay in the park? No, it will not. And a solo home run by Callie Hevelin. For Hevelin, that's the sixth time this year that she's dialed long distance. Some highway robbery for the last time up. The throw to third is not in time. Off the glove of Clefermas, and that will easily allow Johnson to score from second. And through it now, three for three today with an RBI single. Johnson makes it 4-1, Bama. Line, stab by Sykes. The throw back to first is not in time. Yet another terrific play defensively. Kahalen. Lifts one to left, Whitley long run, and she makes the catch. There's a swing and a miss, and the first one, two, three inning for Ole Miss pitching. Rebels need some runs as they head to the bottom of the six. Torrance trying to finish the deal. There's a drive to deep center field, and it's gone. Furbush absolutely unloads on that Torrance pitch. That was a rocket to center, and it's four to two. It sure was. There's a fly to deep center field. This one's way out of here for Kamoku. She dials long distance, and it's now four to three. The Rebels are back to within one, thanks to back-to-back -back Jacks. Wow, how about that? Kayla Kamoku. Smith has driven in 37. And you can add to that total there. A base hit up the middle. Lasseter will score. And we're tied at four here in the bottom of the seventh. And there it goes. And it's going to be a walk off for Maya Stevenson on senior weekend. And the Rebels rally and knock off Alabama with a four spot in the bottom of the seventh inning. Stevenson driving in Whitley for the game winning run. It's 5-4 Rebels. This has been a presentation of ESPN, the worldwide leader in sports. Thanks for watching, and enjoy the rest of your weekend, folks.